Hello, it's me, Jessica Viva, and it's literally 3am, and news just spread that Jihyo and Daniel are dating. So according to Dispatch, Kang, Daniel and Jihyo were seen on a date in the neighbourhood of Hanam in Seoul on August the 1st, and they reportedly began dating in the beginning of the year. The two met at Kang, Daniel's home, and Jihyo drove there in their own car. The two stayed within the neighbourhood's Yuen village, so... Baekhyun, did you know this was happening? Were you giving us subliminals? So, a source close to the two idols apparently shared uh, some bay close to Kang Daniel and Jiho introduced the two to each other. Dispatch further reports that Kang Daniel and Jiho meet once a week, or over once a week, sorry, and they were reportedly together on the day before Jiho flew out the country for Twice's world tour, and the day after she flew back in. Jiho also, also, <laughs> God, I cannot read, girl. Also reportedly met with Kang Daniel after his solo debut showcase on July the 25th. Dispatch states that Jihyo and Kang Daniel are already an official couple in Twice. One of the members reportedly gave her a ride to Daniel's house and then returned to pick her up again. In response to this report, Twice's agency JYP Entertainment and Kang Daniel's agency Connect Entertainment stated that they have seen the report and are checking the facts. My first thought on this was literally what everyone else was thinking, like, girl, ain't Daniel his own CEO? Like, is he gonna check with himself? <laughs> so now that I've covered most of the news, if any of you aren't up to date, I'm just gonna give my opinion on the couple or what I think, because I just kind of wanted to make a one-off kind of thing, just because I feel like people will ask me what my opinion is. So they haven't been confirmed, like, 100% yet, but Dispatch are, like, nearly always right, so... You know, if they are a couple, then I'm not going to be mad at it. I think they'll, they'd will they be a very good looking couple together and, you know, they're both great people. So I can imagine just them being a nice couple together. I honestly like, and I say this in my last video about Gen Kai, I think, I've never really been that bothered when idols have started dating. I've always just wanted them to be happy. You know what I mean? And I remember back in 2000 and whenever when Taeyeon and Baekhyun started dating, for those who don't know, they're my ults. I was so happy, I was filled with glee. Oh my god, my ults are dating, they're gonna be together forever. But now that I'm a bit older, I'm just like, oh, well, they're a young couple, they might date, they might break up. Whatever it is, I just support them and want them to be happy. And I've never wanted to make a big deal out of other people's relationship because ultimately it's their private life. And sometimes I just wish dispatch weren't such like scum like I wish they just stopped snooping around because a lot of the time I feel like a lot of relationships between idols are ruined because of fans and like I know it's like a sad thing to think about but I think Kai and Jenny's relationship was impacted by the media exposing them Baekhyun was really heavily impacted by them getting exposed so I do worry about Jihyo and Daniel's mental health if like they're dealing with this like exposure okay but basically if TLDR I just want them to be happy and you know they break up they stay together I'll be there hoping that they're happy you know and I think that's all we can do and what we should do because at the end of the day it's their relationship you don't have any control over their relationship you shouldn't hate on them for being in a relationship they're your faves so you should just be happy for them when I think about it I think attitudes towards dating have changed a lot more now and I think it's more welcomed and people are way more supportive but I still think like in the back of my head just having your relationship exposed like having your private life exposed to like millions of people all over the world like I think it's just something like really mentally draining if that makes sense so I just you know I hope this doesn't like affect their relationship in any way because you know I mean, if they wanted to be public then you know they would go public <laughs> But, you know, it's really, really early in the game. I just wanted to make, like, an overall opinion. Even if they aren't a couple, my opinion still stands. It'll just be for, like, another couple. I just think, you know, we should try and normalise dating in the K-pop industry. So, you know, shit don't happen. I don't know. I have no idea where I'm going with this. But if they aren't a couple, then whatever. But if they are a couple, I'll wish them the best. But, you know, I'm not going to fuss over it. I'm not gonna turn it into my life. I'm just gonna support and watch Full Metal Alchemist and cry at the sad episodes in my room. 
honestly though, I can't wait to see all of like the delusional fans that are gonna be like, this is fake, they're just doing it to, to get clout, it's obviously fake, why can't you guys just tell you all sheep, it's all fake, like, it's so stupid, like, it's so sad that you just can't grasp the fact that your idol has a life outside of being on stage or on variety shows. Just accept it and grow up. It's so sad. Like, this was this was so common with every single K-pop couple that's like, came out. It's always, it's fake, it's fake, it's fake. It's so sad and immature. Whether it's real or not, like, dating someone for clout, like, there may be a slight profit, but it's just not worth it. Honestly, like, this is such, like, a random couple. Like, Kai and Jenny, I can, like, kind of see them together because they're both, like, dancers and they both just kind of have, like, a similar vibe. But, girl, honestly, Daniel and Jihyo, like, they're legends and they're nice people, but they are, like, the last people I think I'd see in a dating scandal. But, you know what it is? As long as they make each other happy, then good for them. And that's... All that matters. <laughs> I feel like I've repeated this so many times. Take a shot every time I say happy, happy, happy. Oh, did you see how I slipped that in? Yeah, 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 I know. I'm funny, I'm here all week. So that is all from me. Obviously I would love to hear your guys' opinions on the whole exposing and their couple. If you ship them, if you don't ship them, just tell me anything you want in the comments. It's a free for all at this point. Obviously, you know, if you're a new viewer, I would love for you to subscribe because it makes me want to continue making videos. I swear I'm not always this boring, but you know, I felt like I had to make a video about this because everyone else will and I'm a clout chaser and I want validation. So please do subscribe, follow my Insta and Twitter if you want any updates or if you just want to see me talk about Fullmetal Alchemist then cry about how much I love Taeon. So with that, you guys better stand Taeon, okay? I always say it at the end of every video, but I don't think that many of you are doing it, so you better stand on, okay? And watch Full Metal Alchemist. Okay, bye!